All right, so here in Utah, in the winter it gets cold. I got 32 degrees right now. It's pretty chilly and I'm in the city. So we're gonna be going camping this weekend and we're gonna be out in the desert and a lot of people don't understand but the desert gets really cold at night. So to combat that, we've got the H, the H Calroy, H Calroy. Not entirely sure how to say that. Uh, diesel heater um, that we'll be using to warm up the rooftop tent here. So pretty excited about that. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and see what we got in the box. So when we open it up, first thing you got is an outlet tube and an inlet tube. Those will come out. So here's your outlet, here's your inlet. You have an exhaust tube. Um, you got all your fittings that you're gonna need, all your fittings for your hoses, um, your hose clamps, everything like that. You have the little muffler that you're gonna have with it to keep it quiet. All right. And here is the unit itself. So, I'm gonna pull this out. All right, let's take a look at the unit itself. Bam! So, right off the bat, I really like it. It's not big, that's my hand, you can see. Small, compact, it's pretty, uh, pretty stable. It does have removable feet, uh, which I'll show you here in a second. Fuel tank is on top. You do have this nice uh, LED touch screen. Uh, comes with a remote. And there's a lot of things. Uh, your power back here to control your fan. So I'm really excited to see how this works out. Here's your, your LED touch screen. Nice remote. Here's your Here's your power for everything. It's a pretty nice little unit. Okay, so the one thing I did have to buy for it already, um, and that's simply because this right here is not gonna reach from the ground where I have it up to the rooftop tent. So what I did, was I just went and bought some flex coil duct right here. Basically it's three inches, connect those two. That way I can run this from the Jeep battery, one of them. I can put it down here on the ground so I can run from the Jeep battery to the heater that'll be on the ground. And then I can run the hose up into my tent um, and let's see it'll be about right here is where it's going to go in somewhere right here it'll pop in the side of my tent so once we get it all hooked up we'll go through this again and i'll show you guys but it's going to be pretty awesome and i should be able to stay about 60 degrees in the tent which is way better than the 20 to 25 that it's supposed to be so pretty excited about this and getting it set up um it's my first go around with a rooftop, or not with a rooftop tent, with a heater, like a diesel heater. Um, not really sure how I like the whole, it's gotta be connected to a battery. I feel like there's gotta be a better way to do that. But as of now, this is what we got. So we're gonna check it out. So we just spent the first night in the truck, or in the tent with the diesel heater. It was 12 degrees and uh, so yeah it was cold but that diesel heater is really nice i stayed warm and i stayed toasty all night long like without a doubt i'll show you how i had it set up let me walk over there and i'll show okay. you so like i said you bought me some of that three inch duct and then just connected it right to the heater 
The exhaust is going out that a direction. The intake. The intake is coming out that direction, right there, and the wiring. So I had to add some wires because I or I blew my little 12 valve, my 12 volt plug that I had. So I blew that. So I ran some wires all the way up to the battery to the clamps right here. and cold yeah that kept me really warm really roasty toasty all night but it is cold